So if you think that you've noticed more snakes this summer than say earlier in the year, you might be right. North Carolina is home to 37 different species of snakes, and they tend to show up when you least expect it. In this morning's Weather IQ, meteorologist KJ Jacobs shows us how the weather increases the chances you'll come across a snake. I'm not a fan of snakes. In fact, when I hear the word snake, I run away. However, I spoke to a snake expert who runs towards them. Most snakes in North Carolina are non-venomous with an average length of nearly three feet, but some are even bigger like this one in Gaston County. North Carolina wildlife expert Jeff Hall says snakes are generally not going to bother you unless you bother them. Hold your step a second, give the animal time and space. It's gonna go on about its business doing whatever it's doing. Uh, it doesn't really want to be caught by you, found by you, touched by you. <laughs> it wants to go on and do about its business. And it's much more afraid of you than you are of it. Hall says snakes serve a purpose. For example, they could be a sign of rodents near your home. Some non-venomous snakes even prey on venomous ones. Snakes are just like any other type of wildlife. And the more we learn about them, you know, we can kind of appreciate them as part of that uh, ecological space. Six venomous snakes inhabit North Carolina. The copperhead, cottonmouth, eastern coral snake, pygmy rattlesnake, diamondback rattlesnake, timber rattlesnake. Snakes are out of hibernation during the spring, summer, and fall. They are cold-blooded reptiles, so they prefer temperatures in the 80-degree range. Snakes will often move into the shade when temperatures get above 90. I'm at the lake, one of the top three places you might encounter a snake. We like to sunbathe and they like sun basking. And bodies of water provide a food source and a way to cool down. The most common snake near lakes is the northern water snake. And on a hike or a camping trip, be prepared to cross paths with a snake. They like wooded areas. We've all heard the phrase snake in the grass and there's some truth to it. Snakes like grassy areas and you should watch for them while working in the yard. With your Weather IQ, I'm meteorologist KJ Jacobs, WCNC Charlotte. Snakes get a bad name. They yeah, do. the black ones are good. Yeah. They well, serve a purpose. They, they I mean, all yeah, are they good in their uh, own my, way. If I see a yeah. copperhead, it's gone. Bye-bye. <laughs> <Yeah. Bye -bye. laughs> I mean, a lot of times people attack the snakes that are not poisonous. You know, black sure. snakes, uh, you know, yep. king snakes, yeah. things like that. But I have not, normally by this time of the year, I've probably seen at least a half dozen snakes. I've not seen one yet. Not one. Year. Really? Not one. Now, probably what's going to happen is I'm going to walk outside. You are. Here, out of the weather patio where you guys were. <laughs> yeah. These snakes all over the place. They're uh, coming for your sprinkle. Uh, oh, here they go. Let's,